write an algorithm to perform insert or nq, delete or dq, and get friend operations in Q data structure. Or a question, how to check Q is empty or not and full or not. Q is an abstract data structure where insertion of an element occur at one end known as rare and deletion of an element occur at another end known as front. Q is known as first in first out FIFO because first item added to Q will be first item to be removed from Q. Let Q is represented by an array list of size max. An algorithm for is empty. Value of friend and rare can be verified to check Q is empty or not. Q is empty if friend is minus one or friend is greater than rare, not otherwise. So is empty returns true when friend is minus one or friend greater than rare, else it returns false. Algorithm is named as is empty, which returns a Boolean value true or false. It returns true when the value of friend is equal to minus one or friend greater than rare. In other case, it returns false. Algorithm for is full. Rare value can be verified to check Q is full or not. Q is full if rare reaches max minus one, not otherwise. Is full returns true when rare is max minus one, else returns false. Algorithm is full. It returns a Boolean value true or false. It returns true when the value of rare is equal to max minus one. In other case, it returns false. Algorithm for NQ operation, which is used to insert an element into Q. Perform NQ operation, insert a new element at rare of Q. NQ operation can be performed only when Q is not full. That is, Q has sufficient space to accommodate new element. Q overflow occurs when NQ operation is performed while Q is full. When first element is inserted into Q, that is at friend equals minus one, friend will be set to zero. Value of rare will be incremented by one before placing new element into rare of Q. Algorithm NQ, it takes a parameter, which is a new item to be inserted into Q. In NQ algorithm, first we need to check whether Q is full by calling is full. If it is full, we have to display that Q is overflow else we can perform insert of element new item into Q. First, we check the value of friend. If it is minus one, we have to initialize by zero. And now we have to increment the value of rare by one at the new place of rare, the item to be stored. So first rare will get increased by one plus plus rare and the new item will get stored at the new rare value. Algorithm for DQ operation. Perform DQ operation, delete front element from Q. DQ operation can be performed only when Q is not empty. Q underflow occurs when DQ operation is performed while Q is empty. 
value of rent is incremented by 1 to delete an element from Q. Algorithm for DQ operation. First, we have to check whether Q is empty by calling is empty. If it is empty, the condition is Q underflow. Else the value of friend to be increased by 1. So friend plus plus. Algorithm for get friend operation. It returns friend element of Q without changing the value of friend. Get friend operation can be performed only when Q is not empty. If Q is empty, it returns null. Q underflow occurs when get friend operation is performed while Q is empty. Get friend algorithm, it returns a particular value. So return data type indicates the type, the type of value to be returned from friend place. First, we have to check whether Q is empty or not by calling is empty. If Q is empty, the condition is Q underflow. And then we return the value null because Q is empty. Else we return the element which is present at friend. So we write return list of friend. Next algorithm for display operation. It traverses elements of Q from index friend to rare if Q is not empty. Display algorithm. First we display the value of friend and rare. Then we check whether Q is empty or not. If it is not empty, We display the value of elements which are present in the queue starting from friend to rare. So we display all the elements.